In the ATL, that's my homeboy. Watch your back if you're gonna walk alone, boy. Cause everybody in the homeboys trying to get rich. You could get hit even if you know him, boy. Uh, we the kings of the south. Pies in the oven, grills in the mouths. Count stacks is a usual norm. College Park Bank here where the hustle was born. So peace up and A Town down. Hi, everyone, and welcome back. It is Toe of the Week, and I'm excited to share this design with you guys again. It matches with the nails I did on Monday, those beautiful uh, tropical teal and yellow nails that I did with all those rhinestones. Of course, the toe design is always a little bit different, but always matches perfectly, so I can't wait for you guys to see this. And also, just to let you guys know, say goodbye to this background, because this is the last video you will see me sitting in front of this. So it is due time for me to move. I will be moved in less than a week. I'm excited, I'm scared, and I'm nervous, but 20 years is a long time to be somewhere and it's time for a new change and a lot of positive good things are gonna come out of this. Um, I've packed up all the good and left all the bad. So, and I wanna thank all of you guys. I know I'm getting a little emotional trying to hold it. Uh, but I wanna thank all of you guys for your love and support. Thank you for the kind words and the encouragement and all your prayers. I do appreciate it. So um, please help this channel to grow. If you are new to it, please hit the subscribe button and the notification and um, help this channel to grow. Link down in this box, I have a channel called Keep It Keto, which I load all the nails and outfits in there too for now until that until this channel gets bigger. So if you don't mind, go and check out that channel too and please help this channel to grow. Again, thank you guys for all your love and support. And I will see you guys in my new place. I love you guys very, very much. Say goodbye to this background. Let's get started on this toe design, everyone. God bless and take care. Hi, everyone. So here's what I chose to go with for this week's toe design. A beautiful teal and yellow design with stamping and rhinestones. If you'd like to see how I did this one, then please continue watching. Hello everyone and welcome back to another beautiful toe design, again matching with the nails that I did on Monday. If you didn't get a chance to see that, definitely go check that video out. I did a stamping design and that's what I'm doing here. I'm using all the same supplies. So I started the nails off just solid color with this beautiful teal the Kiss Gel that I got from the Dollar Tree. I will list everything down in the box. This one is called Cool Yui. What an awesome name for it. It's a beautiful greenish teal. I love it. And then I'm going to be stamping, like I said in my nail video, I'm gonna stamp the same design like on my nails here. I'm going to do that on the big toe only. And I'm working with this plate here I got off of eBay. I will list that down in the box for you. And I'm working with that image right here. And I'm using a generic stamper and scraper, just a clear one that I got off of eBay also. And I'll be using this yellow for the image. It's Paparazzi, got this from CVS, and it's called Love All, a beautiful, uh, bright, it's not like a neon, just a beautiful summer yellow. And it's, I, real, I really like it, if you look at the nails here, it went on a little bit sheer, and I love that. And then I will be putting on crystals through the design on just, you know, through the design on the big toe. It'll be these, the AB uh, teal color crystals. I'll be using the smaller ones in there. And then the clearer ones that are AB, I'll be using those just to kind of sporadically put through. And then on the tips of the other toes, my little toes, I'm going to just tip it with yellow just to add in yellow because toes are so small, it's hard to do stamp designs. You can and I definitely could do that, but just to save on some time, I'm just gonna put a little bit of yellow on the tips, and then I will add in some of the crystals in there too. Not sure how I'm gonna do them yet, but I'll add some of the small crystals in there. I will be using the ASP glue to glue them on, and then I will top coat everything with my Sesh Feet Dry Fast Top Coat. So, I am going to do one stamp and some of the yellow tips, and I'll be back to show you what I'm doing. All right, so I have got the yellow on the tips on most of them and one of the stamping done on this one. So I still have to stamp this and show you the yellow on the tip there. I am just doing it like a normal French, like I've showed you guys before. I will draw in here. I'm just gonna get a little bit on the brush and you're just going to set your brush down right in the center to start with 
and then just give it a pull up like that. So put it down and pull up with your brush. Put it down, pull up with your brush. And that's where it, you can, you know, you're basically, you can make a pretty straight line doing it that way. And I did end up having to do two coats because this yellow isn't real opaque. That's why I liked it when I did the image. So just like that, and then get your little free edges. And we'll let that dry up before I do a second coat. And I'm just gonna, while it's wet, just take my little tool here and a little cleanup brush and wipe off any of this extra here. I see a little bit of the teal too. Clean that up. We'll let that dry <clears throat> and then I'll be doing the stamping. So getting the stamp design here to set up. Right there is the image and I'm only doing half of it because the toe, you know, I want some of the teal to show and it is showing kind of a lot of it like on the other foot like you show, but I'm only going to paint half of it here. Just one half this image. And then we're gonna scrape it one more time. Grab my stamper. Get it stamped, that's a good stamp right there. And I'm gonna do it more over to this side, coming this way. So, just gonna set it down right there and just kinda roll it around the toe like that, and see, then it leaves some of the teal open just a little bit, but it gets the image in there. And since it's gonna be hard to get in there with tape, I'm just gonna real quick just clean this little corner here like that. So I'm gonna let all of this dry up here. I'm gonna do a second coat on the, the small toe there, clean off my plate here, and I will return then to show you me doing the crystals. All right, so now I have got the bling going on the one big toe and then just one little small stone, stone in the yellow part. I thought that'd be cute. And I left one open here and one here to show you guys. So I've got my little tray here with the glue in it and the stones. And I'm using an orange wood stick and a Q-tip to pick them up. So first I'm gonna dip in the glue of the orange wood stick. Just dip it in right there and put some glue into my areas that I need glue. Here, let me draw in a little bit better for you guys. Okay, I've got the glue there in the middle and then I'm just gonna put one little dot there for a small one, put a dot there for a crystal. We'll do one there and one over here. Then we'll dry this glue off of there and get my Q-tip. Start by picking up the big one. It's always harder to do this when you're on film. So we're actually putting a bigger stone than I did on my nails in the center here of that teal color because the toe is bigger. Then we're going to get these little ones and go around in the areas where the glue is. Oh, I thought I got one. So I'll just put them down around into the glued areas here. One in this little, <coughs> excuse me, one in this little flower. One over here and one right in here. Just like that, just to have the bling going around. And then on the yellow part over here, I'm just gonna put a little dot of glue right there. And then I'm gonna grab another tiny little AB crystal and put it right there. Hopefully you guys seen that. Yep, I was on, okay. Whoops, knocked over my tray here. But we are done with that part. Let's slide up a little bit. There we go. And then I'm just gonna push these little stones into here, to this tray here. Okay. So now we have got that part done, all the bling and the beauty. Now I am just gonna clean everything up, top coat everything, and put my cuticle oil on, and I will return to show you the end product. Alrighty, another toe design down. And I love this one. It looks so great for the summer. The yellow and the teal together is so beautiful. Looks so great with my nails that I did on Monday. I really love the way they both turned out. Love the stamping, love the yellow, love the stones. It's just so bright and so beautiful. Another beautiful summer design. 
I will have one more look, and after that, it's going to be fall looks. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Definitely give it a try, and thanks for watching. Everybody take care, and God bless.